Jenny Rowe took over this summer as head of the Friends School of Portland. She is a community-minded leader, and she spoke with Leslie McVeigh about her plans to build on the success of the school's first six years. Well, Jenny, welcome. Thank you. Welcome to Maine. Yeah. Brand new. Yeah. <laughs> so you've had a history in working with children and being mm -hmm. head of school or teaching in a school, mm -hmm. most recently the community school in Tamworth, New Hampshire. Right. But before that, you, you've had experience in Friends schools. Right. Tell us a little bit about your background in the Friends schools. Well, I really didn't know very much about Quakerism at all until my husband and I had the opportunity to go to Monteverde, Costa Rica, and that was a good 25 years ago. Um, we went to the Friends School there, which had been founded 30 years before that, um, and we came as volunteers. The school was quite small, and after our children were born in New Hampshire, we thought, what a great community to go be part of, and so we, we moved back as a family, um, and uh, I worked part-time as a teacher, and then I became director there, um, so I had six really great learning years working with Quaker teachers and working with families who may have been Quaker but mostly were not and many Costa Ricans and Costa Rican families have joined the Monterey Friends School community so um, that's where I did a lot of learning. <laughs> well the, the, the Quaker history is, is all about education, mm -hmm. as well as the peace movement, mm -hmm. um, from the days of George Fox and working in the prisons, teaching the mm -hmm. prisoners. Mm -hmm. um, tell us why you were attracted to the opening here in, in the French School in Portland. Um, when I was in Monteverde, um, at, at the end of my time there, I knew that the French School of Portland was opening. Um, and I just kept it in the back of my mind and thought, oh, that'd be a great place to go visit. Um, but when I first came back, I became the director of the community school, and it was exactly at the same, the same timing. So it wasn't till last year when I met one of our, the friend school teachers at a, um, at a course at Antioch, and I started asking him more about it, and then got an email and, and just thought, this is something I would really like to explore. I, would l I'm so delighted to be part of the Friends Education Network. It's a, it's a wonderful thing to be part of the Friends Council on Education, which connects you know, all schools that are Quaker um, to the teeniest schools to, um, and international schools like the Monterey Friends School to, you know, to the most well-established big name Quaker schools. And it's, just, it's great to be part of a larger, um, linked to a larger group of schools with the same philosophy. <laughs> Well, you're taking on some challenges as well because the, the French school needs to expand, needs to grow, needs to move. Mm -hmm. And so that's one of the challenges you'll be faced with. Right. Um, fortunately, the school is in a, a really good place. Um, in, its, in its life as a young school, it's been recently accredited with you know, the highest of accolades by the New England Association of Schools and Colleges uh, last year. I think the school, even though it's young, has many well-established practices, faculty who've been there since the beginning, um, and very talented faculty, um, families who adore the school. So we're fully enrolled. We've got um, some great um, support behind us. And now it's, it's navigating those waters of, can we stay on Mackworth Island? It's a it's a wonderful place. Is there a room for is there room for us long term? As you allude to, so we're in the exploration stage. And if we are if we can go elsewhere, that that might op open the opportunity for us to to grow in size as well. So those two issues are really linked. Well, I think it's wonderful you're here, and I know that the. The programs aren't just during the school year, they go through the summer. Right. We've had some of the kids in here right. for their movie camp. Right. And we look forward to all the new um, programs and, and messages coming from the school about uh, what's going to happen. It's very exciting. Well, thank you for being tuned into that. Welcome here and let us know how people can contact you if they want to okay. know more about the school. Right. So the school. If, if people go to friendsschoolofportland.org, um, they can find out about admissions and summer programs and events that we hold at the school during the year. And our phone number is 
9-6 is my number. That's fantastic. <laughs> you know that. Thank you for being here, Jimmy. We'll get you back when you're a little older yes. in the program. That's right. <laughs> Thanks a lot.